Hey folks, Jen or Murder Fan here, taking a look today at the Bombshell version 2.0 from HotVapes.com. Let's take a deep dive. So let's take a look at what comes in the box from Hot Vapes. It has their uh, war the girl on top. Coolest vape you ever had. I don't know, it's kind of warm. Anyway, it comes in a nice box, hot girl on the top. Got a little manual. Vapor's Guide, nothing too in-depth, fairly decent, mechanical guarantee, and it comes with a charger for a 26650. Single cell, charges fairly decently, 126650 of the new green variety. Apparently they don't make the orange ones anymore. These are 3,500 milliamp hours. The orange ones are 4,000 milliamp hours. These ones, according to the gentleman from Hot Base, are supposed to uh, have better charge cycles and last longer. Comes with a top, a bottom, and let's look at the other parts. I got my kick at the ready. Now, basically, the addition between this and the original bombshell is uh, that middle piece. Now this is a spacer, uh, in case you don't want to use a kick, then you can go ahead and use the mod without it. But basically, you know, the original bombshell was just the top and the bottom cap. It had an 18650, and if you look at my video, it the 18650 was loose in there. So basically they just made some more space inside, they didn't have to change the size of the mod at all. And now it fix, fits a 26650. Now this little, whoops, yeah, yeah, I drop everything. Uh, let's go hunt for it under the desk. There it is. Anyway, um, this extra piece uh, screws down and holds the battery in place. Now once you have that in place, you can either put in the spacer, if you're not going to use the kick, um, which has a brass piece in it that sends the uh, current to the top. If you were going to use the kick, you would place the kick inside that silver spacer. So let's go ahead and give that a try. Take the spacer out. Grab our kick. And drop that in. Make sure the spring is sitting on the metal there, and give it a twirl. She's all together. The threads are actually smooth. I'm just incredibly clumsy. Don't mind me. Anyway, so, I mean, my pretty much all day drag around mod lately has been the Helix. 26650 lasts for days. But, it's hard to use a kick with because the kick would have to go in first and yeah I'd have to use a 26500 a shorter battery now, as you can see the bombshell is a little longer than both the other 26650 mods and it is like the helix less girthy that's what she said than the bombshell now it is a little longer than the helix about the height of a kick which makes sense. Now, I love the grooves on the bombshell. I love where the seam is and how it disappears when you screw it on. I love the design of I can use the 26650 or I can use this nice little metal adapter that fits the kick in it. The only drawback to that is I then have to use a 26500. Less battery, less time. Now, for me, as well as the kick is designed, it is a little wide. And I do like the Slimmer Helix better. That's just me. It's still a great mod. So that's a close-up look at the bombshell. Um, yeah, I like it. Um, it. It's still not my favorite switch, um, but I haven't really had any problems with it. Um, it's fairly decently priced. It comes in a kit with a battery and a charger. Um, 
I mean, it's it's helix sized. I wouldn't put it up against the helix because it, it's doing the uh, kick thing. So <sighs> I think this is a better built mod. Um, I love that where it goes together, it's um, seamless. Um, I actually do kind of like the grippies. I prefer the switch. Um, I prefer the design for using the kick, the little internal ring. Um, but to use a kick, I have to use a smaller battery. Um, and, you know, for a woman, that's a huge mod. Um, and I have big hands. So, I mean, while it fits nice, it's almost too big for me to cart around all the place. Um, the bombshell's a little easier. Um, the design is a simple modification of the original bombshell. For the price, it's a decent mod. Um, it works great with the kick. It uses a full 26650, um, any 510 connection. Not really much more to say about it than that. It's a decent mod. I love my 26650s. Two days of power and a, you know, 8 mil tank. What's not to love? Uh, glass blown tank and tip also from hotbabes.com. Uh, give them a look. Thanks.